Welcome back! In this video, I'll show you how to add your photo to a clipping mask. You can add images to shapes in your purchase template. First, you'll need to upload a photo. To upload a photo, select the Elements pane on the left-hand side and click the Upload button. You'll be prompted to choose a file from your computer. Once the file is uploaded, simply click or drag it to add it to the template. The shop owner placed a shape on your template that the sample photo is cropped in. This could be a circle, rectangle, square, or any other shape. You can size your image up or down by using the corner anchors or the scale button in the toolbar. You'll want your image to be slightly larger than whatever the shape size is. To add your image to the shape, hold the image over the shape and sample photo for a few seconds. You'll see the shape turn a transparent green color so you can center your image appropriately. Then, you'll see the sample image from the template you purchased replaced by your photo. You're able to move the image around within the shape by clicking and holding while dragging it. If you need to move the shape, highlight the shape and image together and then move it around until it's in the desired location. At any time, feel free to save your work by clicking the Save button in the top left corner. If you can't get it to work, you may have accidentally deleted the sample image from the template, which erased the clipping mask function as well. In that case, you'll need to add the function back in. To do that, make sure you've added your image to the template. Then, go to the layer section on the right-hand side. Make sure your image is above the shape in the layer section. Right-click the image in the layer section and select Create a Clipping Mask. You'll see an arrow pointing down next to the image, indicating it will clip to whatever is in the layer below it. If you deleted the shape on accident, or would prefer your image be in a different shape, you can add a new shape in. Click on the SVG pane on the left-hand side and click Shapes at the top of that section. Select the shape you want to use and you'll see it placed on the template. Make it the size you want it to be, center it if you'd like, and then follow the same steps as above by adding your image and creating the clipping mask function in the layer section. If you have any questions, you can watch help videos or reach out to support by going to help.template.com or by clicking the help link in the top right corner.